Welcome back, folks. I'm here at the York Train Show in York, Pennsylvania. I'm about to give away this MTH Premier Triplex steam engine. This is the same one I ran in my video a couple of weeks ago. We're going to go find some random person and give them a train engine that they'll never forget. So let's go. This year was all about gratitude, thanking each and every one of you for the support you give to this channel. So I wanted to do something special. So I packed up my MTH Premier Triplex, or Triplex, however you say it, and I took it with me to the York train show with the hopes of giving it away. And here is the story. I went to the show full of gratitude. The whole point for me this time was to meet and connect with folks and get an opportunity to give away the steam engine. I wanted to do something big for my audience, and I felt like this was just about as big as I was going to be able to go. I thought to myself, what's one of the coolest things that could happen to me at a train show? I went into the building and it was tough. I was talking to people, meeting different folks, and that's when I met Christian and his mom and his dad. And I found out that they had driven five hours to the show so that we could meet. It was such a humbling experience. And it was that moment that I knew that's the family. That's the family that I'm gonna give this train engine to. So I'm here at the trains.com booth, and I'm here with my friend Christian and Tony, who I've had the pleasure of meeting today. They drove, what, five hours to yep. the York show. It's a long way. So I wanna reward them for such a great journey. They're building a layout, they're doing all kinds of great things. So I wanna go grab something real quick, something special. This is gonna be crazy, guys. Be ready. Giving him a train? Take my picture, I'm ready. This is the MT8. Premier Triplex or Triplex. I got I got in trouble for saying it the wrong way. <laughs> triplex, Triplex. I don't know. Doesn't matter because it's not mine anymore. Because I'm going to give it to Christian and Tony. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh my God! A big boy! <laughs> almost. It's almost. It's almost. It's more powerful than big boy, right? Powerful, yeah. Oh yeah. Can't say that either. Okay, I'm gonna get. So I got my friend Sid. Sid, come here. This is my buddy Sid from Sid's Trains. I always bring him along for the technical stuff because that's yes. what he does. We're going to take this over to a test track so Christian and Tony can see it run for the first time before they take it home. All right, let's, let's go. go. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Test it. This one, it just so turns out that Tony is building a train layout for their family in their own home. And in fact, his dad is also a collector. So right away I knew that this train engine was going to a great home. All right, so hopefully I boxed it up well. It takes just a little bit of packing material. I also have to give a huge shout out to my friend Sid from Sid's Trains for always managing to be in the right place at the right time. Sid was there to help us get the engine out of the box and put it on the test track. You go ahead, you take the top off of it. All right, take the middle off. Nice. Perfect. So it's wrapped up really carefully. Now, what's tricky about the triplex is that the tender is attached to the engine. So when you, when you get it out of the box, it's kind of a pain. I'm not going to lie. It's a huge pain. So, what I recommend is using a friend. So, we're going to pull straight out like Sid's doing with me here. You guys take care of them. I think we're going to continue to transform the way that these train shows work if we keep getting creative, if we keep doing new things. That's how we're going to bring in the next generation to this hobby. There are tons of people out there. There are tons of kids out there who are collecting trains. I get emails all the time from parents who are looking to get into the hobby and helping their kids out. It's growing. <laughs> Seeing Christian's face was priceless, especially when we got to hand him the remote control to blow the whistle on the engine for the first time. So now we're going to hand the remote to Christian so he can blow the whistle on his new train. And he's going to have the white button right here. Incredible, isn't it? And then this is your bell button, so you hit the yellow button for the bell. 
All right, so that's, that's a wrap. We're going to put this back in the box. And away it goes to its new home. Tony, thank you. A few days later, Tony sent me some pictures of the triplex on their layout. It was just great to see it in its new home. So to Christian and all the other young folks who watch this channel, thank you for being the future of this hobby. It's in great hands. And I hope you enjoyed this impromptu video of my quick trip to the York Show in York, Pennsylvania. As always, a huge thank you to all of my subscribers and everyone who's been supporting this channel. My name is Chris, and this is RBP Trades. We'll see you next time.